Hey, what's going on guys? Today we're going to be doing a little bit of gaming performance with Yuma Digi A9 and I have a few games already loaded up on here. Genshu Impact, Call of Duty Mobile, Roblox. We do have uh, PUBG as well on here as well. So I definitely want to get into a few games right now, but let's just jump into the roadblocks real quick. All right, but if you're new to the crew, do me a quick favor, hit both the like and the subscribe button as well as the bell icon on your way in. I truly appreciate that. And let's just jump right into the first game of the day. Let's see if there's any like anything cheaper than, here's one, 2000. Let's get that in, in red. All right, so I got that in red. Um, I just, I don't know where my car is. I'm gonna get, get out of here and I'm gonna open up that icon with the car next to it. Let me see, exit. So the driving on here is like really weird. This is not really like fun to drive with this car or anything like that, but it's semi playable on here, you know what I mean? But uh, I just don't really like like this game whatsoever it's like let me see right signal headlights so let me see what we're really getting into i really have no idea where i'm going or anything like that next event and so we'll play the next event which is this one let's just play that one and let's just jump right into it. All right guys, so let's just kind of check out the gameplay on here. I'm trying to find out what Nitro is. Alright, so so far it's really smooth. And Y is nitro, so that's pretty cool. This is pretty crazy. It looks really good too. So everything is looking good on here as far as the gameplay, it doesn't stutter. Um, you know what I'm saying? I was trying to see the controls because like... Four seconds left. Two seconds left. Alright, so I actually finished the race. That was pretty crazy. So let's jump into the next game. Guys, the next game I want to play is Genshin Impact. So let's just jump right into the Genshin Impact real quick. Okay guys, so we're gonna play a little bit of Genshin Impact right here. I'm gonna let you guys know how the graphics do, everything like that. My first chance to fight beside you. I think we'll make a good team.
So the, I noticed that the, the when you're walking and moving around, it's not like the most responsive in the, in the entire world. So, you know, let me see. So basically what I'm trying to say is that it's not going to be like the best ever performance, but it will run. All right guys, so this is the, basically like the entry point. And you can see it does run pretty smoothly. Let me show you how the Knights of Lavonius conquer our adversaries. All right, so let's just wait for this part. So look how this is really awesome graphics right here. Like um, if there is a there is a slight delay or whatever, but it's very really realistic. So as you can see, pretty decent gameplay on here. So just really smooth graphics. Look, I'm playing this thing with no issues whatsoever. And um, so I, I definitely think the, G, the G25 is really capable of playing, you know, very good, very smooth graphics on here. You know what I'm saying? Damn, these things look crazy. So I guess that's over. So that was pretty. That was pretty crazy. Um, so yeah, this is awesome when it comes to the graphics. I think it's definitely playable, and it's not even that too not hot as well. Um, so let me see if I could get past this part. it does give low graphics and you know low high frame rate so I just want to put that out there
All right, so the graphics look pretty decent so far. It looks like the it's keeping up with like my movements and things of that nature. So overall, it looks really pretty, really smooth on here so far when it comes to the Call of Duty Mobile. Um, like I said before, so uh, you know I can't complain right now. It's been able to play pretty much game very well on here. So let me know what you guys think. But um, for a budget device, this is actually pretty decent, right? All right, so really good graphics on it. Let's just jump into some PUBG Mobile. All right, guys. So last game we're gonna play is PUBG Call it PUBG Call it. Oh, not PUBG Call of Duty. Just PUBG Mobile. And let me just show you what the graphics look like on here. So it's basically just giving us that smooth and medium with the balance, but no HD. And you could play low, right? But we we're gonna do smooth and medium. And let's just jump into a quick game right now. All right, guys. So this is uh, the match right here. Let's just jump into it. He must have saw me on the roof right there, so let me just see. Oh, damn. That was crazy. That was crazy, right? So he's just waiting at the door right there with the stun gun. Oh, damn, bro. All right, that, that was crazy because actually my team was like working together real quick. And he shot me through a wall. That was pretty crazy too. So this team is actually pretty good and the graphics on here are actually really good, right? So I'm actually able to get some really good gameplay on here. Um, not the craziest gameplay ever. It's, it's not going to be the smoothest when it comes to the frame rates, but... Um, it's decent. The most I could, the best I could describe it is is, is decent. It's not going to stutter though. It definitely won't stutter, which is good. Got him. Oh damn, he got <laughs> This is crazy, bro. Like, uh, this game is crazy because, like, you don't know which way somebody's going to be coming at. So, yeah, that was pretty ridiculous, right? Yeah, this is nuts, man. But overall, I think this device does play really good. It does play games really good. Overall, you can you could definitely get some gaming done on here. All right, so let me know what you guys think down below in the comments section. I don't know, this team is just way too advanced when it comes to like, like trying to compete. They, they, they got the one up on us every single time, but Who got me this time, bro? Yeah, that's crazy. This team is like very strategic All right, I'm gonna get right back with you man, but yeah, I could definitely say that this does Perform really well and we also do get a really large screen really large battery 
720 display, which is also pretty decent. The OS is good um, and the battery life is pretty decent on here. It does kind of drain quick when you're gaming. Uh, I started, I think I started at like 70% when we started this gaming, but I was playing Genshin Impact for about one hour earlier on and Call of Duty for 17 minutes, Roblox for 10 minutes, Asphalt 9 for 10 minutes and PUBG for 10 minutes as well. So that's pretty much my usage. And you know, we get some decent, we get about five hours, I would say on this phone, screen on time, if you're using it straight through. So I just kind of want to let you guys know that it'll be about five, five and a half hours, maybe six, depending on your usage and what games you're playing and what apps are open in the background. But I'm going to get right back with you. And this is the A9 gaming review. So let me know what you guys think down below. Make sure you, if you found this video helpful, that you also leave a like and a comment down below to show your support and appreciation. And I'm gonna get right back with you in the next video. Later, later, group, peace.